was the literal center of the family. He um, literally made parties happen. He came, he made sure everyone was fine. Now at four, a family remembering a teen who had just started his senior year in high school, killed, run down, hit by two cars, and police say it was done on purpose. Hi everyone, I'm Susie Sa. And I'm Amy Johnson in for Juan Fernandez. This is KKL 9 News at 4, streaming on CBS News Los Angeles. That victim was only 17 years old. Yeah, he was outside a party in South LA early Sunday when he was targeted. KCAL 9's Jeff Nguyen is live in South LA this afternoon. And Jeff, you spoke with that young man's family. Susie and Amy, the family did share with us their sorrow today while detectives at LAPD are going through security video to hopefully find a lead in this case. He was the literal center of the family. Laura Valenzuela is talking about her nephew, 17-year-old Matthew Lobos, who police say was hit and killed by two cars in an industrial part of the Florence area early Sunday morning. He was just a really great and fun, loving kid. The LAPD says the teen was among 150 people who gathered on this stretch where business owners say street racing often takes place on weekends. Detectives say an argument broke out before two vehicles ran over Lobos. One of them, a white Acura, was ditched against a pole. Police don't have a description of the second car. At this growing memorial, a close friend of Lobo's came to honor his memory with a custom T-shirt. At the home that Lobo's shared with his family, his grandfather tried to stay busy as the family prepared to head to the mortuary to make funeral plans. Friends and family say he had just started his senior year at nearby Santee High School. His teachers just barely got to know him a little bit, but from the GoFundMe, I seen that some of them actually replied saying that he came alive during debate. He was very outspoken. From this picture, you can see how Lobos was close to his grandmother. His family says his goal was to graduate from high school and to move away from South LA. He wanted to be a realtor. I think once he turned 18, he wanted to take his realtor license. I think he just wanted to make more of himself, gotcha. first and foremost. Matthew Lobos' close friends say that they will honor him as they graduate high school because that is exactly what he wanted for himself. Right now, detectives say they do not have a motive for the deadly attack. We're live in South L.A. Jeff Nguyen, KCAL 9 News. All right, Jeff, thank you so much.